Alright, all right, we'll kind of give you the before of the pantry. It's looking kind of bare. So we've got some condiments here that I kind of stocked up on last month. But yeah, that's good. And then we kind of have some snack items. Well, not very many snack items. We don't have a lot right now. And then this is kind of my husband's section. And that's all his dairy-free stuff that he can take to work and work through. And then the thing on the side, it's pretty empty. I've got one bag of potatoes here on the floor and some juice. You can see we uh, still have some vegetables left over from last month. Not a lot, but we do have some. Yeah, some tuna we'll fish, yeah. some salmon, and... This is a jar of grape juice from downstairs and a jar of black beans that somebody brought up for me. Um, one little thing of syrup left. Got some peanut butter. We did not get into the new stuff, which is good. Some salsa, relish. But yeah, this shelf is pretty empty. We're going to get everything nicely filled up. My cracker bin is empty. And a little bit of noodles left, but my pasta. We are out, almost completely out of pasta. So, it is time to fill up this pantry. Yeah. So this is a quick overlook at our Walmart order. So it does look like a lot of food, but I am hoping that this is the last grocery haul before this baby comes. So I got some extra things because I really don't want to go to the store after the baby's born. So, for our pasta area, we got four bags of the wide noodles, two bags of the medium noodles. Um, I have some people who like a preference with this when we do our, uh, our beef and noodles. They like the smaller noodles with that. So I'm happy to accommodate with them. Um, spaghetti, again, we like the smaller noodles, so we get the angel hair pasta for spaghetti. We have a little bit more beef. I ordered our beef, and it should be here hopefully next week and that'll be just wonderful so I don't have to buy it canned anymore I can can my own I got six packages of tuna again just kind of stocking up we do have some in the pantry but that's a quick easy meal that my kids can throw together and it's healthy and convenient and mama doesn't have to cook if I don't feel like it I got my 12 cans of tomato soup I am starting to run out of my homemade pasta sauce so I got four jars of this for, um, what did I get this for? I'll have to look at my meal plan. I think it's a uh, chicken parmigiana. <clears throat> my husband and my oldest son like hearty beef barley soup, so they're going to divvy that up. And we got more peas, more carrots, and more corn. I usually get the big corn. You can see that over there. <laughs> But uh, this particular Walmart that I went to this time, uh, I went to a different Walmart because I had a doctor's appointment. But uh, they only had the small cans, so we got the small cans. And these carrots, I'm going to cheat and I'm going to put them underneath meatloaf. And I'm, that way I don't have to slice raw carrots. I can just throw a can of carrots in there. Quick and convenient, that's what I'm going for. Some clam chowder, same thing, convenient to have in the pantry for a meal for the kids. Uh, my oldest son likes to get this every once in a while. Angel hair pasta with herbs. He really likes that, so I got that for him. Random water bottle. And some more macaroni and cheese. My, uh, my sixth son's birthday is today, and he uh, asked for macaroni and cheese from the store so we got some macaroni and cheese for dinner tonight so we'll probably use three of them and then the other three will sit in the pantry as an emergency backup meal macaroni. for some macaroni and then um, I got some more salsa my oldest son loves spicy stuff so that is his and then we got the mild salsa for the rest of us again just stocking up on some more condiments my husband really likes miracle whip so he enjoys putting those on or that on his sandwiches. Got some more Parmesan cheese, another bottle of ketchup, four big containers of syrup. We got some grapes for chicken salad. Um, I will have to go back. 
uh, well, my husband will probably pick it up for me, but um, we'll need some more grapes mid-month for chicken salad. But, you know, what if it doesn't happen? It doesn't happen. It's not a big deal. Three bags of apples, lots of bananas, and then this is kind of my husband's snack section. He enjoys the Life cereal, and the Teddy Grahams are dairy-free for him. He takes those to work every day, and then he enjoys the Pop-Tarts. So, we got two bags of this, and my kids got into one bag already for breakfast. I got four loaves of bread. Somebody got into a bag of bread last night to make some sandwiches. No big deal. We got three bags of the restaurant style tortilla chips. I'm not sure why they gave us lightly salted, but that's okay. We will eat it. Uh, so this is actually from Aldi, not Walmart. Walmart did not have the great value hamburger buns. They wanted to substitute with um, the ballpark brand and it was gonna cost almost three times as much. And I said, no, I'll run into Aldi and grab hamburger buns. So. That's from Aldi, but that's going to go in our <laughs> Walmart haul because that's the only thing we got from Aldi. Some more uh, margarine. We got this last month, and I still have quite a bit in my freezer, so this will just be added to that. Smaller container of sour cream. Not too small. It's a 24-ounce tub. Uh, my husband got a humongous tub, uh, I think, just a couple days ago because we actually ran out of sour cream, and we needed it for tacos, so he very graciously just grabbed some real quick. Some heavy whipping cream, cottage cheese. I'm going to use um, this for snacks as well as in, um, uh, we, we make a skillet lasagna dish. So instead of using ricotta cheese, it all just gets thrown into a pot. It's really good and we use cottage cheese for that. Got three two pound, yeah, two pound bags of tater tots. We're going to do tater tot casserole. I ran out of blueberries from Azure Standard and I just did not feel like putting in an order and doing that and messing with that before baby comes. So we got some from the store. Um, got another big bag of flour and a large package this time of paper towels um, just, to, just to have on hand my kids are cleaning up more messes than what I am right now so <laughs> I use a lot of paper towels a gallon jug of canola oil for baking some more laundry detergent so we don't run out I got some more aluminum foil because we were out of that um, postpartum care stuff for mom these are actually so these are the best thing uh, that I have found for me these are actually bladder protection but I have found, for me personally, that these just work great for postpartum care. Um, they're just, yeah, they're wonderful. Never have a baby without those. <clears throat> uh, some more um, body wash for my husband. Again, just kind of, kind of making sure everybody has what they need. I had a happy helper um, <laughs> take this apart last night. They, they got into it to use it. Um, but I got two tubes of toothpaste, more prenatal vitamins for me, and some little band-aids for my little guys because we always run out of little band-aids. If anybody knows of anywhere I can get band-aids for like a large package of band-aids for super cheap for little fingers, let me know because I can't keep it I cannot keep them in the house. But I think that's pretty much it for our Walmart haul. And up next will be Sam's Club. And we're back with a Sam's Club order. So I got a big thing of toilet paper. We still have some downstairs, but I do not intend to run out. And I got a 25 pound bag of sugar for various canning projects, cooking projects, and yeah, I don't want to go to the store again for a while. More, uh, Oh, words are escaping me. Dishwasher detergent. More dishwasher detergent. Just have a backup. Um, my husband takes these gummy vitamin C, so that's for him. I got more vitamins for my kids. Some more ibuprofen, because we were running really low on that. Some more cheese slices for sandwiches. <clears throat> and then uh, my son asked for crab cakes for his birthday. So I got some imitation crab 
uh, crab legs, crab pieces, imitation crab to make some of that. A big box of wipes. I don't even know how many are in here. I don't know how many packages. 17. It says 17. 17 packages of wipes because with a new baby in the house, we're going to use those. More taco shells for taco night. They're actually cheaper to get the name brand at Sam's Club than they are at Walmart. So that's a win for me. Same thing with the, uh, the tortillas. It's cheaper to get the name brand at Sam's Club. So that's what we do. We got crackers. We got had a happy helper already dumped that into my into my bin. But I got two packages or two containers, a baking powder, um, big thing of crackers, more lunch meat, um, a two pack of vinegar. I use we use that in our dishwasher as a rinse aid and because we have really hard water here. And then I also use that as a, uh, a bleach replacer in my laundry. And then back here, I got three boxes of Pepsi for my husband that hopefully should last him more than a month. We will see. But this is what we got from Sam's Club. I should also mention that I have a package. Uh, some things had to be shipped. So I have a package of olives coming and something else and I cannot remember what it is. Kleenex. Kleenex is the other thing that I got and oh we got a 10 pound bag of frozen chicken breast. So yeah so I've got a package of olives coming and a big box of Kleenex coming in the mail. But yep that is our grocery haul for the month of March. And here's a quick overview of what the pantry looks like when it's full. So my husband's got his snack stuff up here. And then I just put our emergency macaroni and cheese over there. Um, we got some of that out the other day because the kids wanted to try it. We put the extra condiments over here, all the chips, tortilla chips up there. This is our taco area and I put the extra shells from the old box up here because they won't, they won't fit up there. Filled up my cracker bin. Still need to get some elbow macaroni because Sam's Club didn't have any, so I didn't get any. Filled up the spaghetti noodles. That's all nicely filled up. Um, we still have a spot for the olives when the olives come. Kids had clam chowder for lunch today and thoroughly enjoyed that. The veggie section is all filled up. Got my syrup, stock syrup stocked up. And... Yeah, the pile of Pepsi down there. So he is stocked up for quite a while on that, so that'll be good. But yeah, that's how we shove everything into this little pantry, coat closet, snow storage <laughs> area. And yeah, vinegar can go up there. Yep, so that'll do it for the month. And then some of the rest of the items go in my baking cupboard. And then we still have quite a bit of canned um, vegetables and stuff down in the basement. So one of these days we'll get around to doing that. But my basement is whew, a disaster. And yeah, it's not really ready to be on video yet. So we'll get there. But this, is, this looks good for today.